Well, there's money. Yay! There we go. Cool. I'm just getting out of here. Oh boy, I have the flippers. Okay, so okay, safety. Um. Well, there's North Palace. Hmm. Okay, let's head to another map. Oh, hello there. Uh, I want to go to Death Mountain. Two, yeah, so two heart pieces, which I'm honestly not that worried about. I think that's my last magic container. Yeah, I did not remember this quest having flippers. Perfect. A. I'm actually kind of surprised to see you up this late, Kodum. Or old gold gaming, I should say. Since you're in tomorrow, I'm surprised you're up this late. I'm also about to die, I just realized this. I'll be fine. Okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna Well actually I can't count this as a heart container piece or a heart piece with the flippers because it's not a heart piece. Unless I get a heart piece here, that'd be fantastic. Just because there's three heart pieces with the flippers doesn't mean I'll find them easily. Well I mean, yeah, I kinda will. Because they they kinda have to be around water. I haven't beeped in a while, so let's not bring those times back. Even though my gameplay will probably get better when I'm beeping. Alright, seems good. Ooh, watch that. Is this actually sw- Uh... Crater? That's not good. I, I just kind of get stuck. Okay, that's not good. That's a mistake. Should not have. When I, so when I see that, I assume I can swim through that, but it leads to a wall. So great. Oh, you give a hook shot spot in an area where I could only get to once I have the hook, the flippers. Did the creator just kind of? I don't want to assume anything, but did they kind of slack off near the end a little bit? Like this quest didn't really make many mistakes up until that. That is the last uh, magic container. I actually do kind of want to reveal this great palace. At least see it. Oh, God. oh wait. I know where one of the heart pieces is. It's in hell. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, my God. I'm legitimately stuck. I got a... Wow, I saw flock. Fantastic. All right, let's try this again. But, yeah, that last heart... That one heart piece. I am going to get it, obviously, but... I'm not gonna enjoy any second. I'm not gonna enjoy a second of it because it's gonna suck. Oh, it's playing this music again. It's a secret entrance to the castle. If you're ready, I. Why would I pay money? This is not what I was expecting from North Castle. Is there harpies here? That'd be great if there's harpies here. A house here hides the entrance to the castle. Well, big house like this. That's totally not suspicious at all. Why this? Final Fantasy 1 music, by the way. Oh, wait, no. This is Final Fantasy 2 music. This is, um... J uh, just a Final Fantasy 2 battle theme. Okay, there's nothing here. I'm just being very paranoid. That's just gone now? For reasons? Guess I triggered it? Somehow? Ah, a house here hides the entrance. It's the second of or the third of three houses the one that clearly is the entrance i mean kudos for trying to be cryptic but eh. could have been a little bit better i guess okay so this is the final dungeon vol 9 north castle you must take the castle back from ganon zelda waits at the top enough said you don't need to say anything else. Saving the world from Ganon. That's all you gotta say. <laughs> Alright, well, what's in this house? Uh, nothing useful. Okay, so. Four hard pieces. I know where one is. And there is unmapped territory. So, let's start with that. Now, I don't know what that'd be. It's, it's the fastest speed that you can possibly spin anything. So, 
Like, I've already spent hours. Those are just stairs going into water. But I spent hours trying to get it. And no luck. Don't forget to check out the dock northeast of Moblin Woods. The dock northeast of Moblin Woods. I don't know. I'll have to look for that. Okay. Cool. I don't know why I would want to do any of this, since I have flippers. You created this in such a way that I could get that with the ladder, but if you can't get this without the flippers anyway... Also, there's, uh, there's something there. I'm stuck. Alright, I can't go down there, even though it looks like I could. Oh, yes, there's something up there. So what is up here? Only flipper people can get up here. Hmm? Well, that certainly looks important. It's just gonna be harpies, right? Yep, take it, I don't need it, and I'm sure it'll help you on your quest. Despite the fact that you're stuck in a cave and you can't get out because it's all water. Okay, so yeah, first of all, is there anything unmapped? That's what I need to check for. Okay, so there's unmapped territory right there. Here we are. Yeah, can't say I'm surprised this is what I'm seeing. This has literally been the latter half of the quest. Well, I was hoping that'd be a hard piece, but okay. In the interest of time, sprinting through some of this. Ah, yes. Uh, wow, the guy spawned on me. Jeez. So many places he could have spawned. He's, nope. I choose a player's X and Y. Hey, there we go. So that, I think that's the three heart pieces I needed. Okay. There's one. Somewhere. Well, the Death Mountain cave system. Wait, hold on, wait. I'm missing one heart piece. I know exactly where it is. I missed nothing. I missed absolutely nothing. There's one more heart piece, and it's in Saria. It's in the game in Saria. Ah, uh, shoot. I'm like losing track. It's not here. Oh, it is here. Saria? No, oh, that's Saria. It's whatever that town is. Rudo? It's uh, this house. I am stuck. Oh my god, I'm tempted to mute the music because it just drives me to insanity. Wow. I actually didn't miss anything. Like, there's nine overworlds. That's 11 by 16 times nine. That's how many screens there are. Just the odds that I could have missed something is insane. But I didn't. I thought for sure that I was gonna miss at least like like a few heart, heart pieces. And yeah, just to show you guys, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. In one second, well, in 16 frames, it does that. Oops. Yeah. This sucks. This is literally going to be what I'm streaming until this... It actually got kind of close. I speed this up because I don't feel like waiting. But last time I tried this, I had like a third of my magic. So like my, my magic bar had like a third of that. And, um, maybe half of this health, so I can use, a lot of them are facing that way now. A lot of them are flucked back at me. That's why I'm losing health. But now I can actually take the hits. And I also have the red mail. I, I wasn't going to wait for that. I wasn't going to make it. I want, I, I honestly want to know if anyone else has gotten this. If someone is kind enough to look up and see if anyone else has gotten this heart piece. Wait. There's another step? There's another step to this game. Like, killing this Octorok's not the last one. Oh, he's showing everything. Yeah, I definitely have everything. He has gold armor? At this point, you just want to load damage as fast as possible. For probably the- This room. You're gonna get to that Octorok in the corner. 
It's doing the same thing I'm doing. This is where it's purely luck based. He has gold armor though. There's no strategy to this. Does he have a better sword? He has a better sword than me. Hmm. I missed some things. See, whenever I do recorded Let's Plays, you guys don't see any more than I I let be shown. There's this may seem like really absurd, and it is, but I've I've had I've done so many things like this. So this really is nothing that special. Granted, doing them at 2:10 in the morning, probably not the best time. Because the last time I did this, I almost fell asleep. I think it was stream three. Is this stream three? I did this. Like the, the end of that stream was this too. I think it might have been. And it's just this. I did it for like an hour, hour and a half at that time. You think this quest is password protected? I think I could get in there and just, you know, change the puzzle myself to make it less terrible. Like, honestly, if I could do that, I wouldn't cheese it. No, I would put reflectors around the walls, like basically move the Octorok down one, right one of where it is so that the magic would hit it probably at some point because they the magic shots would never die and maybe reduce the time that you have to get it so it's less of will it make it there and more of will it make it there in time that would be better welcome back to nine villages you must take the castle back from ganon zelda wa waits at the top ah yes so I did not get that last heart piece. My time is just too valuable to sit there for hours and hours and hours and hours and hours just watching magic endlessly ricochet through magic and 99% of hitting me back. Um, this will just be another one of those quests that maybe at some point in the future I'll go back for it and we'll see. I honestly can't care enough. Like quests like Umbral Cloud or um, My Rule. I should go back to those and actually finish them. Uh, but this is just like, nah. And you know, I do want to address... On, like, it, it is currently Dece December 3rd. On, like, October 18th or something, already, like, after I had already started doing this quest, um, the creator actually uploaded an update to this quest. Adding a second, I think it was a second Octorok in that puzzle, in the lower left corner, so that you could actually have a higher chance of hitting something. Well, apparently that update, I could not just overwrite my my um, my quest file. It's, it, most quest updates, you can do that. Like, with my dev development, when I update my quest, I don't need to make a new file every time. I just replace the file, and it usually just works out. Um, no. Not with that, I got an error saying uh, you must ha make a new save or you know something along those lines. So I'd have to start the entire game over for that one heart piece. Mm. No, I'm not gonna do that. That's a little absurd. Uh, 26 hours for a heart piece. No. Okay, one day you guys won't be where I need. Okay, I'm gonna go around then since you're gonna be like that. So yeah, I'm not doing that. Uh, oh, I was holding down, and Link just said, no, we're going to go out. Okay, cool. But anyway, yeah, so we're at uh, the final dungeon, level 9. And okay, that was not the boomerang. I don't know why I thought it was. Well, I'm definitely going to need the hammer for this upcoming room. So, as infuriating as it is, I will be going without 100%ing this quest, just because, good lord, not dealing with it. Which is really saying something because I've put up with a lot of bull crap for 100%ing these quests. Yeah. Not putting up with that. I have fought bosses for like 10, 10 hours collectively for this kind of stuff, but I'm not gonna do that. Mainly because it's RNG. I have terrible luck. Like, in general. Because, like, I've, I've seen. I watched Pick's Caliber's attempt at it. Like, it sounded like it only took him a few hours. I was... Oh, thanks, Ladder. I was at it for probably about five to six hours. Collectively, be, like, during streams, at the end of streams. And... 
uh, a little bit on my own. Like five or six hours. And n magic never went to... Oh, once again, I'm holding it down. See, that's... Down and up. Okay. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Wow, that was cool. So, as annoying as it is, I mean, I'm still going to say 100% of this quest because I knew exactly where it was, and I tried my best to get at it, but the game just didn't want me to get it, so I 100% of this quest as far as I'm concerned. Uh, okay, could probably giant bomb them, but I'm not going to waste it. Yeah, it's annoying that the ladder just doesn't want to work. It's like, I shouldn't even have the ladder anymore at this point. It was a red bubble. Okay. I'd like to not be in the water. There we go. So yeah, I'm going to be finishing this quest tonight because... What more is there after level 9? I don't know. So we will see. Although, oh shoot, I forgot. When looking around on Pixcalibur's videos, I did notice that he did have an upgraded sword and armor. Uh, I'm gonna hope they're in here, honestly. I'm just gonna go for that. I mean, obviously, if I get through here and they're not here, I'm gonna have to hunt them down. Which is gonna be nightmarish. But, let's not think about that right now. Let's uh, hope that it's in here. I kind of doubt it, just because it's level 9. I mean, the quest did set a precedent of two items per main dungeon. Nah, I don't know. I'm not going to be too confident. So well. Okay. Gonna need this bad boy. There we go. Well, that's actually very fortunate. Because now we're in this situation. I would actually really hope I could find that sword. One shot these uh, fires. Heck, I think I could one shot these darkness too. Eh, well, so much of that. Uh, can't believe I haven't ex. Well, no, I shouldn't say this now. I was gonna say, I can't believe I haven't accidentally used a giant bomb when cycling for my lens. Hopefully that won't happen. Really hope that won't happen. Oh, hi, Windrose. Enemies that knock me around like ragdolls with enemies that will take me all the way back to the beginning of dungeons. What a great combination. I mean, I'll definitely take you guys out over the wind ropes at this point. Couldn't even really... Why were they lined up there? I didn't see the one below me. All right, we're just gonna whip out. I don't know if that's Din's fire. Of course it's not. I can't really tell. Whenever I go to Din's fire, I need to, oh, of course. I always need to manually select it because I can't always tell. I can manipulate these guys. Yeah, I can manipulate them to trap me in a corner. That's fantastic. And you're, oh, that's not helpful. Uh, I just realized, why am I doing this? <laughs> I mean, is the game preparing me in case I don't have the magic key? Also, this dungeon is going incredibly linear. I say as things get very interesting. Uh, well, that slowness of the transition from dark to light. Oh, you came that way. Didn't appreciate that. Okay. Yeah, I have a magic key. I don't know why I was trying to get key. Yep, yep. Pretty much the entire thing. Not really surprising. I'm, I'm just gonna treat locked doors as normal doors, because why wouldn't I? 
They basically are just normal doors when you have the magic key. That whole strategy of not touching locked doors until I need to, well, it's kind of moot. Which isn't typically a situation I am in, you know. Also, let's be clear. You Okay, so you guys are the blue bubbles. Let's just make that very clear. They're right there. That's where those blue bubbles are. Oh my god, that's a lot of the dying bubbles. And a lot of statue shooters. This is going to be tons of fun. This is why this is going to be tons of fun. Oh, I did just get a double kill. If I could stop getting stun locked by these guys. Okay. See, this kind of scenario is just frush. It's just frustrating above all else. Oh. I can't get to you! What happened? Wait. They're stuck! Is it because they're too wide and they can't turn in that? Oh my god, that is hilarious. They are legitimately stuck. I mean, I can definitely kill them, but it's a matter of... They don't hurt me anymore. I don't get it. Are they actually dead? They're definitely still a thing. Let's try that again. Maybe they won't kill themselves? Paralyze themselves? Whatever you want to call that. This is just downright frustrating, though. I mean, I hit B, but I got stun locked because of the 83,000 statue shooters in this room. Alright, well. Uh, let's just go this way. Kind of heading towards the dead end. Ooh, this is fun. You know, let's just outright kill these guys if I can. I don't know if that'll kill the level 3 st Stalfos, but. Oh, uh, this is great. Oh my god, that was great. What the heck was that all about? Oh, that timing. You're dead. over there. These knockbacks are confusing. They just kind of go wherever they want, don't they? Holy crap. Jeez. Things really go haywire sometimes. I find myself in some very interesting situations. Hey, well, I'm up here now. Oh my god. Seriously, ragdoll man. Uh, at least they're all dead. Okay. I see no push blocks. We're gonna have to do some uh, fancy business here. Thought I was gonna do a hookshot trip, but I think. Oh, that's fantastic! Spawning on. Uh, having uh, patches spawn on me is always fun. I'm just gonna do this like this because it's actually working. Not the most efficient way to do it, but it's certainly effective. Just got a rupee from Patra. What was my motivation? Is this a situation where if I don't have the magic key, you can actually screw yourself by using keys in bad spots? Okay, I'm never gonna... I'm, of course, I'm cycling the wrong way. It certainly seems like it. And I do remember playing quests, I, as in plural, that did that kind of thing. So I wouldn't be surprised. Um, nah, there, there's a bomb spot down... There's something all the way down there, and I'm kind of, you know, I'm feeling inclined to check. There is something hidden over here, and I would like to know. In fact, there's probably one on the right side that I didn't see. 
Uh, why did I not go this way? Oh. So I have been to those rooms, they just don't show up on the map? They're on a different map. Okay, note to self. I have actually seen those rooms. They just didn't feel like coming into work. Ooh, that's another safe spot on uh, fire rooms I never knew about. Usually you have to be... A, a safe, one safe spot I've usually used is down one and to the right of the actual wind room. Or the fire room. Like, their fire can't hit you. But it turns out if you're half a tile up and to the left or right, that also works. Little tip for you guys if you struggle against them. If you can if you can t um, keep a safe distance, you, they, they actually can't hit you. And if you're on, like, the right step... There's three of you in here. Nice. I see no push. Let's go up. You know, once again, because no one's in on stream still, uh, I'm going to make sure that everything's working fine with the stream. One real disadvantage to having literally nobody uh, on stream is not knowing if everything's actually working. Kind of frustrating. Well, question. Um, can't have my question answered yet. Okay, there's not. I just want to see if there's something in these spots. Okay. Can I actually salvage this? I didn't come through here expecting to actually get through. Wow, I actually got through. I just literally wanted to check if I could go left or right because that would change how I'd go through. Well, all right, I'll just do this then. Works out. Okay, you is red boobles. We're gonna pull out, uh, going the absolute wrong way for item cycling. The bubble stunners. So I'm not dealing with red bubbles. Nope. No! God, okay. Well, we're still gonna scan here. Just three to the right, get through the door. Yeah, you're really spammy, aren't you? Well, this is kind of an unfortunate scenario I got myself into. Half step, half step. Good lord. Half step is safe, generally. Something you have one shot on you. Whoa! Okay. Okay. There we go. Uh, cool. I have literally no reason not to grab that. Yeah, having the magic key kind of makes this uh, incredibly easy. Because I just kind of, you know, fly without any care in the world about my key situation. This really is confusing. It's like he doesn't exist? His collision's kind of disabled, I guess. Okay, no, yeah, I was here. I never proceeded because I turned back to see... No, you're going to stay stunned there. There we go. Uh, I was meant to hit you, but okay. Uh, I'm all the way on the left side, so let's just uh, head up. I can't really do anything else anyway. Okay. New strategy? Thought it would be annoying. Actually kind of worked out in my favor. Just dive in the water. Okay. Well, I can't go anywhere else but right. Oh, this just worked out perfectly. Actually, that didn't work out too bad. Ooh, wow, nice. Fantastic. Hit you at some point. Okay. And there are portals now. I do know that. Don't really know 
<laughs> yeah, if you think I'm going down, you're insane. That's just a one-way path that I'm not dealing with. Oh, fun! Ladder act wool. No, 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 no. That actually worked out pretty well there for me. Right when that guy spawned bats. Oh, wow. You guys could not have spawned. You could have spawned in a better spot, but that was pretty amazing. I'm just gonna deal with them this way. Ooh. Nice, nice. Okay. Can't go any other way, so let's just uh, head the way that the game's clearly taking me. Oh, this is great. Uh, let's just do this. Oh, I just realized that there's another 76,000. Oh, frickin' great. Of course you stopped on me right there. At least they're kind of funneled this way. Seriously, statue shooters don't really add difficulty in this scenario. They just make your life irritating. Because they, they they interrupt your attacks. Good lord, what am I supposed to do? Also, it's going the wrong way every time. Uh, there's literally nothing here. Light up the room, please. Thank you. And I think I do need to actually kill you. That's a shame, they'll all come back, but... That's whatever. What's over this way?